Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Truth Council 23 with me, your sister friend, Truth Nunez, and our spiritual council. We're so honored, grateful, and thankful to be here with all of you to share this upcoming seven days uh, read. Uh, keeping in mind, my lovies, we're reading collective energies, so take what resonates and leave what doesn't. You are and forever will be. And what's up to your cousins, too, my lovies? I love y'all, my lovies. Um... Well, you are and forever will be the masters of your experiences of what you will or what you will not into this creation. I am just your humbler, uh, humbler, tumbler, something some called tumbler. I'm just your humble um, psychic medium, channeler, sister friend, uh, spiritual psychologist for you, my lovies, because I adore you. We adore you. Spirit adores you, my lovies. And so much adoration, so much admiration. Here we go with this stuff. Um, I like it. I like it, my lovies. But um, welcome, my darlings. Welcome. Um, if you need to book a private read, you could do so by looking in the description box below or looking at the pinned comment. And uh, the easiest way is to go on the Calendly site and you can book your reads there. Thank you so much, my lovies. Thank you for your likes, your comments, your shares, your subscribes. Thank you for uh, your engagement. Uh, thank you for those that make it to the end of the video. Again, I, I'm like, wow, holy cow. I mean, I mean, spirit told us, you know, but it's just like, I'm just, uh, uh, your dedication to, um, to spiritual development and to, um, stretching your brain really is uh is uh curious to me it's really sweet i, I really sometimes sweeney um i really like it my lovies i really do i really love you um i love this work my lovies i really do i really 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 do um this is not for entertainment purposes uh this is actually real spiritual work um and uh the fact that you come here and do it um is uh is amazing to me so thank you my lovies thank you for your super chats thank you for your contributions um thank you for everything that um that you do in your life um to um to show love to the to the collective in whatever way that is uh, thank you my lovies 2 11 2 12 and thank you liz what's up liz liz be present 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 go liz it's your birthday go liz it's your birthday it's your birthday it's your birthday liz is getting ready to have a birthday my lovies but anyways um we want to get started by honoring and thanking the name robert the name rebecca honor and thank uh o'connor o'connell Donahue, Donnelly, uh, Beverly, Victoria. Uh, my, my butt cheek is itchy. My, 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 uh, my left butt cheek, the bottom. Somebody could have had some type of, a baby with a diaper rash, my lovies. Uh, being cautious with the babies with the diaper rashes, but, um, honoring and thanking our spiritual council. I want to honor and thank my grandmama. Abuelita Gladys Nunez Maldonado. I also want to honor and thank my grandpapa, Abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez. I invite you to do the same. I do honor and thank your trusted ancestors, those that protect and love and guide you. I invite you to honor whatever religious force, whatever spiritual force, whatever makes you feel good, grounded, and connected to the all. As you are in this experience, something about an ankh. Um, you can also take something about the ankh life. You can also take a moment of silence to be in silence with yourselves. And that's also more than enough, my lovies. Let's get started, my lovies. My lovies, lovies, lovies. I love you when you love me. <laughs> That's how it feels. That's how it feels just being honest, just being real. Mm. We promised that 6,500 subscribers, we're going to do a special giveaway. I said I was going to give away that necklace. I gave it away to a customer yesterday. <laughs> Not a customer. I don't see people as customers that come to me. Um, as a sister friend, um, as a... Um, as a council member, um, someone that came to me yesterday and had a in-person read, um, I gave them, I gave them the necklace. So we're not going to give that necklace anymore, but, uh, we will do something for you. 65, 6,500 subscribers. We're going to do something special. We're going to do something special. Maybe we'll do a raffle. Maybe we'll do a raffle. Um, to go Raphael. Um, we're going to do something special for you because we adore you. I want to do something special. This is something special. Faluma ding 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 da 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 na 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 da 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 na na da 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 da. Faluma for some of you, dang. <clears throat> Clear those throat chakras. We got a little button, my lovies. Your sister friend's trying to collect little charms for you, my lovey, so we could use little little charms to get extra meanings in the readings. Um, Faluma ding ding ding. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. A Toyota Sequoia. 
Toyota Tacoma. Toyota Camry's Toyotas are in the house, my lovies. Y'all like Toyotas? Toyota for you and your spouse, my lovies. They're reliable vehicles. I, I used to want, when I was younger, I wanted like a little Camry. I never got a little Camry. I went with uh, the Nissan. I was loyal. I've been loyal. Actually, I've, I'm still pretty loyal to Nissan. It's just, once it, it's not broken, don't fix it. And they've spoiled the shit out of me. They have spoiled me, my lovies. They have been so lenient with your sister friend. Bless Nissan. Bless Nissan, my lovies. Bless the Nissan because Nissan has blessed your sister friend. For some of you, you're looking at vehicles, my lovies. For some of you, you're comparing vehicles. You're buying a new car, my lovies. You're going to go far. You're buying a new car, my lovies. For some of you, actually may need a new car, a reliable car, because you are actually traveling far. I've been really... Um, Nissan has taken good care of your sister friend. That, let's just put it that way. I mean, I've also given them a lot of money, so... I had, like two maximas before them i was i had a chrysler which was like i was like uh uh, <laughs> uh, uh. i had three maximas actually i had three maximas and then i went to the nissan rogue and then the nissan pathfinder and i've had a couple of nissan pathfinders let me find the path Faluma ding. For some of you, you're wondering what kind of vehicle I drive. You can just ask. You just asked. <laughs> I like that, my lovies. I like that. She's always in her car. <laughs> She's always in her car. <laughs> Little nosies. <laughs> Is that right? I'm an open book. I'm no crook, my lovies. I'm an open book. Faluma, ding, ding, ding. I'm even in an open book for those that want to hurt me. People that want me to lose my vehicle. <laughs> they want me to lose my vehicle, my lovies. That's some evil shit. Ain't that some evil shit, my lovies? They put things in place so your sister friend can't eat. They want to see your sister friend on the street, my lovies. Ain't that some shit, my lovies? Dang, my lovies. Why y'all come? I'm mean, like, why y'all come here? Oh. Why y'all come here, my lovies? Why are you living your fear and come here? Everything is coming in for a reason. Evil souls. Obsessive souls. Obsessed with harming others. But they go to church. <laughs> to the all, to the all, to the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy to your divine wisdom, to your all-knowing, to your all-being, to your all-seeing power. There's certain people that make me never want to go to church, ever. If you're there, I never want to go to church, ever. The shit you do behind the scenes, never would I want to be in church. If you're somewhere, I'd rather leave. To the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your divine wisdom, to your all-knowing, to your all-being, to your all-seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? To the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy. And even that war turns them on. Even the hate they feel, that turns them on. They love drama. They love hate. They love evil shit. I'm telling you. Something in the field is nasty. To the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your divine wisdom, to your all-knowing, to your all-being, to your all-seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. To mamá Merce. To mamá Merce. To mamá Merce. To Shango, to Shango, to Shango, to Yemaya, to Yemaya, to Yemaya, to Papa Legba, to Papa Legba, 
se papa legba se elegwa se elegwa se elegwa tu oshon tu oshon tu oshon tu ogon tu ogon tu ogon se la santa muerte se la santa muerte se la santa muerte se kalima se kalima se kalima to the all to all of the trusted loving ancestors of all of those co-creating this work what are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages to all the trusted loving ancestors of all of those co-creating this work? What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages to all the trusted loving ancestors of all of those co-creating this work? What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and justice, in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and judgment, in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and mercy. What is up? What is up? What is up? Hot stuff. How's it flowing? How's it going? What's popping? What's cracking? We're reading for my darlings. Reading for my darlings. 11, 11. Reading 11, 12, 11, 13. A reading for my darlings. It is true. We're reading for you and we love you. You know that is true. My lovies, let's do it. My lovies, get to it. My lovies. We're reading for the next seven days. Um, Your sister friend got quite a bit to do. So, but I wanted to do this for you because I adore you, my love. So we're going to start with um, the Trickster's Tarot wants to speak with you. Uh, so we wanted to speak with you right away. So we're going to get right into it. We got Nine of Cups. Okay, well, we got uh, Wells. Wells, we got Wells Fargo for some of you. Um, we got a wish fulfillment or illusions or dream states or delusions. Um, everything is coming in for a reason. Uh, some type of a wish. We have a wish fulfillment or wishful thinking um, or some type of a hope or a dream. Um, there is a shedding of a skin here because uh, 11, 11, 11, 12, 11, 13. So a Cancer, um, a Scorpio, a Libra. Um, you could be dealing with Cancer, Scorpio, or or Libra energy for some of you, or Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy here. Um, some type of a, of a of a renunciation of a situation, changing perspectives and ending something. So there is an ending. Um, judicial procedures. The judicial procedures have been very very present for a lot of you. Um, so all types of procedures in the spiritual courts that will then manifest in the physical courts to bring some type of an ending. This could be related to a death or some type of injustice that was made. Um, in the preliminary, there was a lot of emperor in the reverse energy present um so even the fact that i'm feeling all of this heat right away or all of this irritation right away for some of you you could be dealing with really ruthless people uh overstepping their boundaries um you could be dealing with stalking as well stalking was very present in the preliminary um people uh again bribery energy was also very present in the preliminary so these are the waves that you're riding um spirit is asking you this poseidon energy has been very present as well you could be seeing a lot of esoteric uh, figures of Poseidon for some of you, like different, uh, you could be seeing a lot of paintings of Poseidon, a lot of Priscilla. You could be seeing a lot of, you know, images of Poseidon. You could be seeing even, you know, things that kind of look like Poseidon or what we, you know, kind of like um, the physical form that that energy takes. But um, Poseidon and the deeper, you know, the deeper emotions, you could be dealing with a King of Cups energy for, for some of you, definitely a lot of Scorpio energy, um, death energy, uh, but but um, maybe for some of you, you're dealing with people that are more emotionally stable and others that are more t telling tales and fables, something about tales and fables. And here we go with DuckTales energy. But anyways, um, this energy is all present. Um, so right now with the Nine of Cups energy, I would be, you know, try to stay as... as um, aware that there are different energies floating as possible because in the dream state think of the dream state when a lot of people are sleeping at night we are co-creating another reality it's just a little bit more like fluid that reality is a little bit more fluid something about the druids that reality is a little bit more fluid nine of cups energy brings in that feeling of that dream state where you're still co-creating and collaborating but things are not as real as in the 3d or they're not not that they're not real. It doesn't necessarily lose um, something about vitality, something about virility. It doesn't really use, use someone's using uh, Viagra 
I'm getting Viagra for some, um, <clears throat> clear those throat chakras something for some of you someone could actually be going through erectile dif- dysfunction because of all of their anger all of their frustration and the obsession to be quite frank uh 10 of wands energy something about frank uh 10 of wands energy was also in the preliminary so for some of you you could be dealing with a gentleman who doesn't know how to manage uh it could be like a, a king of hearts so it could be uh, a brother a friend it could be someone that is emotionally important or invested in a situation someone's in porno um or for some of you uh this could be a dark skin man or someone with dark eyes uh and dark lies um and or and dark spies um or for some of you um emperor energy emperor energy could be someone um who's like a boss figure or an authority figure or has some type of authority or even for some of you someone's in a gang um or some type of gang energy is coming in that gang stalking energy uh did creep back in yesterday in yesterday's reading so it is definitely present and i'm feeling it um so for some of you you could be dealing with people that are like very lustful very like again emperor in the reverse so these are like adults but they're very like heavy-handed uh overstep boundaries very obsessive it could bring in crooked again organizations of people um just something to look out for because it's like co-creating a dream space but for some of you you may want to like protect yourself you may want to try to like be aware that these energies are floating around but also be aware that you're protected that's what spirit wants you to know nine of cups energy the dream flow the dream state things that are something about dreamscape something about dream works yeah i tell you i tell you the energies are messy the energies are messy 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 And a king of wands in the reverse, of course. A messy, messy, messy. I told you. I told you. I told you. I tell you. I tell you, my lovies. Justice. Libra energy. Justice. Um, For some of you, so I had this dream. Oh, my God. I had this dream. It was quite an interesting dream. <sighs> this is someone from your past. For some of you, something about your pen pal. For some of you, this pen pal energy has been like floating around. So take that how it resonates. There's a pen pal that's been trying to come in the last couple of days, but we haven't really been paying attention to the pen pal. For some of you, 1752, 1752, 177, um, 177th in Manhattan. But um, Manhattan could be significant for some of you. Manhattan is coming in. Something about made in Manhattan. Um... Pen, pen pal energy is present for some of you. A pen pal could be showing up randomly. This is someone that could have gone to prison for some of you because I am getting like Rikers Island. Um, Northeast could be significant. A lot of Northeast energy is present right now. Someone's trying to affect your... This energy of trying to affect your destiny has been very present. Um, but someone's trying to affect your independence. Um, in the dream, it actually came in as, for some of you, this could be, like, an ex. Um, it came in as an ex. Not an ex. It came in as someone you used to mess around with. Um, they want to take some leap of faith. This person wants to take some type of leap of faith. Yep, the Eight of Cups and the Crooked. They want to take some leap of faith. The Eight of Cups, this is... <clears throat> and there is a female, someone's mother or an older female, can be telling them that this is not a good idea. For you as an older female, um, this energy has been present for some of you, especially as an older female or an older gentleman um, or someone that's in a king of swords or queen of swords energy, meaning you're very logical. Uh, you're very just with your words. You're using your logic. The king of swords and the queen of swords energy, um, oftentimes people think that they're honest people. Um, it's not necessarily that they're like truthful. It's more that they say what needs to be said. 
And so they're just. They're just with their words. They're just with their actions. Um, they're not overly in their emotions. Someone's dealing with someone who's in a king of wands in the reverse. This could be you as someone that's supporting somebody. Um... Someone is in a king of wands in the reverse. They're hasty. They're uh, something about they like to wear pasties. Someone could be like into cross-dressing or something like that. Because um, I'm seeing like a man wearing pasties. But there could be also a female that likes to wear pasties. Take it how it resonates. But I am seeing a cross-dresser as well. Um, this person is lustful. They're heavy-handed. The king of wands in the reverse is like a mini emperor in the reverse. It's very related to, I mean... For me, the King of Wands in the reverse and the King of Pentacles in the reverse are almost like precursors to uh, uh, an Emperor in the reverse energy. Like those two energies combined for me uh, really lead to that Emperor in the reverse because the King of Swords in the reverse can kind of operate on his own. For some of you, you could be dealing with a bunch of people like this, to be quite frank. This is why this is all coming in. Um, because in the preliminary yesterday, all of these energies were present. Someone could actually be in a gang or in some type of like crooked group. Tw uh, 21 12 um they could be in a gang or in some type of crooked group or people that are really immature um very reckless um i was listening to some people speak yesterday it was actually a a, a few men and they were like in their early 20s and they were talking about one of them was like i'm gonna i don't have anywhere to like take her like he wants to he wants to like have sex with a female he's like i don't know where to take her i'm just gonna take her and i'm gonna have fuck i'm gonna fuck her in my in my on my parents bed and everybody's like whoa that's crazy and i'm like wow holy cow and he's like yeah it's bigger it's like even the fact that that's in your soul like what kind of energy is working there? Like, let's talk about it. Why would you want to have sex in your parents? I don't know. It's like, it's it's a weird feeling. Someone could have had sex in your parents' bed. Or someone, someone asked uh, Ash, oh, he would go to Ash, Asheville, Ashley Madison. <sighs> For some of you, there is an ex or someone you used to mess around with that could have been, secretly lusting over your mom or your dad this is what's coming in this is what's coming in or you're dealing with someone that's secretly lusting it's like they want to they want to take action they they're a fool they're the fools and the crooked the action's kind of like frozen in space 240 22 47 22 and 11 33 total the action is kind of frozen in time like this is what it feels like like they did someone has like a memory of an action that's like frozen in time or frozen in their space frozen in their consciousness they are always revisiting something they're always revisiting in their soul it's like when they lost control, someone could have messed around with a family member of yours, or this is what you did, my lovies, wherever the shoe fits, wear it. I'm just reading the story because for some of you, this is you. For some of you, you're in this shoe. For some of you, you're in that shoe. So again, take what resonates. Place yourselves where needed. But don't feel defeated because this person is going to feel defeated. We got disappointment here. They have some type of communication coming in that's really going to be disappointing. For some of you, you're also dealing with somebody who is a liar. So yesterday in the reading, Spirit had us revisit something because yesterday the energy of someone um, dealing with a parent that's sexually abusive to a child but black magic around this entity so for example this is a perfect spirit want us to give us like this is a perfect example of black magic around a situation like that framing a family member they went to go put a curse on a family member um someone that was sexually abusive to a child for example <sighs> a person who is sexually abusive to their own child goes and says it's my family member who's actually abusive to this child, knowing damn well that this can get their family member into a hellhole, knowing that they lied, knowing that they spied, knowing that they were perverted, knowing that they were a diddler. They ran and told someone that, no, it's my family member. That's like putting curse work on a family member. In spiritual in spiritual systems, that would be considered putting a hex on a family member. 
especially if it goes through, which for some it's not. Hex works also present. Something about Hector. Um, it'll be it'll be returned to the sender. The return of the sender in that case would be what the court case goes back to this person because they were never being attacked. Do you get what I mean? It's something like that. Spirit gave that to us in the preliminary, so for some of you, that's relevant. Anyways, this person, um, for some of you, someone wants to take some type of leap of faith. You could be also telling someone or schooling someone and letting them know this is not the way to go when it comes to this action you're trying to take. For some of you, someone could be in very heated energies. They're trying to fight. They're trying to argue. You don't even really have anything to say to this person for some of you. Again, everything was coming in earlier for a reason. Your reasoning, the way it came in in the preliminary, thought, intelligence is protecting you. You have nothing to say. You can feel this person's heat because as a um, as an air sign, so here we have air to air to fire, air to fire, Libra. So the divine fem, the divine feminine. For some of you, this could be you as a divine feminine, or a divine feminine is involved in a situation. Empress energy or someone who's just in very feminine nurturing energy and is very comfortable with their with their divine light very nurturing as well but also very critical very just with the words this energy is coming with all types of heat all types of mess all types of fights all types of shit and to this they're going to be disappointed because someone is literally going to it's almost like i'm going to show you you and you're going to feel ashamed and you're not going to be able to play this game you're trying to play and she has the upper hand. The Queen of Swords. Jesus, these reflections, my lovies. The Queen of Swords has the... How do we do this? <laughs> the Queen of Swords has the upper hand in this situation. Someone could also rep get reprimanded by like an authority figure. Eight of Cups in the Crooked. They're stuck. They're really stuck because of their lack of judgment. In the past, this person kept getting stuck. It's like they kept trying to come to you and say something. But the way, for some of you, someone has been Wayland, Wayland Square. Someone's been trying to uh, O'Hare. Someone's been trying to approach you in different... O'Hare be present, present, my lovey. Chicago be in the house, my lovey. Um, Chicago's with your spouse. Here we go with this. Um, they keep trying to approach you, but every time they try to approach you, they're doing it wrong. It's like this energy keeps trying to approach you and it's like every time it fails. Every single time. Since since the separation of you, like at some point you had some type of connection with this energy. But since that, since eight of spades, this person is, is not okay. Eight of spades. They wonder if you're going to walk away. A queen of diamonds, my God. And a jack of hearts, a brother, a friend, a son, a sister, queen of hearts, a daughter, a, ten of, a whole fucking clan of, of crooks that are all not okay. Like, they all don't want to walk away. I, I told you everything came in earlier for a reason. Everything came in earlier for a reason. It's like, why do you even show up? Why are you even showing up, Eva, Evie? Why are you even showing up? This is what's the lack of judgment of a whole damn community. A whole damn community that wants to apologize for all the lies they told. For some of you, I did get something about a bunch of fake fucking witnesses in, in a court case. They want to apologize to the Queen of Swords. A whole bunch of liars, obstruction of justice. They were all bribed. They want to commit suicide. They were all bribed. For me, no. We're going through the fucking courts, sweetie. We're going through the courts. We're going through the courts. Everything is coming in for a reason. We are going through the courts. Are you ready to finally stop dragging this on? We're going through the courts. I'm just the messenger here. We're going through the courts. You don't have to be in fear. You were never in fear when you were destroying an innocent life and you knew it. You knew what you were doing. You're only sorry you got caught. A whole bunch of people. For some of you, you got a brother, his wife. You have a sister uh, or uh, it feels like a sister. Something about Aurora. Something about Agora. Here we go with this Agora Hills. A whole bunch of people pretending to be friends, pretending to be loved ones. 
a bunch of paid actors. For some of you, a bunch of paid actors in a court case or in a legal procedure. But you're independent from this. For some of you, these are people that paid to have you not be independent. Do you know what I mean? They paid to not have you independent. They paid to screw some stuff over for you. You know this. You spoke your truth. Nine, nine, and you're in wish fulfillment to the nine of pentacles. For some of you, your dreams are coming true. And these people are really upset. Alliance, they all, alliance to cause fury. This was a lesson and you're going to get good news of a marriage, of a commitment. There were, there were, they were, they were all allies in this bullshit. They were all allies in this death or bringing a death to a situation so that they can get some type of treasure. They all collaborated to do this. They thought that they were being persevere, per perseverance. They thought that they were going to have luck on their side, but they were told, they were told this was going to be a suicide mission. Now they're all pissed. Look what wants to peak. Look what wants to peak. Now they're all furious. This is not, this is an insincere apology. For some of you, if you get an apology from a clan or a crew, it's an insincere 31, 11, 31, uh, 31, 13, 31, 14. You're a temperance angel and you've healed from this bullshit. If you get some type of, um, something about crew necks, if you get some type of apology from a crew of crooks, they wanted to cause an accident in your life through some type of ritual, and they're upset. They're all upset because it really all went back. This was their idea. Their idea was also to cause you some type of an accident. This queen of diamonds, there was a female who was the main perpetrator in this idea. Something about a trainer, something about waist trainer, something about tailor. Ceremony, mystery, magic, of an accident, danger, caution, in injury, earnest. Something about an earnest deposit. This was their idea, but destiny, I, I kept seeing fate. Someone, they even got a reading that told them this was going to be dumb, that you would be in self-love and that the angels love you. That's your destiny because you're a sweetheart. That's your destiny from the start because you're a sweetheart. And these people believe they are right, yet they're attacking someone unjustfully so. So what do you think is going to happen? Now you get to live, learn, and grow. Do you know what live, learn, and grow means? It doesn't mean you get to live on and pretend like nothing happened. No, no, no. No, that's not what works. What it means is now you got to go and put in the work. Now you got to go and actually put in the fucking work to yourself. All of the work that you were doing to stalk somebody else, harass somebody else, and bother somebody else. No, no. Now you got to go and do the work to yourself. Now you got to go take care of yourself, your family, your children, which is you should have been doing from the beginning. Something about Worcester sauce, something about Worcester. Your greed, your fucking greed. Now you got to compromise your greed. Now you got to compromise your greed. Things are going to get a little uncomfortable for this group. I'm just a messenger. I got to take what resonates and leave what doesn't. We're moving through a few different energies. May y'all be in peace. Rest in peace, homies. Bye. All you do is fucking lie. And spy. This energy is, and they're so irritated. Again, I'm just a channeler. And they show up stalking you bothering you harassing you trying to pay to have you harmed trying to do things to have you disarmed and you're just like how the fuck did you get so crazy <laughs> what happened to you what happened to you? <laughs> it's like you're looking at your little brother or your little sister like the inner you the little you is looking at them like what happened to you? I never thought you would be this fucking crazy. I never thought. What happened to you, my lovey? What happened to you? So a gentleman watching this, what happened to you? Maybe this is you as a gentleman asking, what happened? What happened to you? It's for you, my loveys, as a gentleman watching th this. Th this. Th <laughs> something about Thomas. What happened to you? What fucking happened to you? Something about philosophy. What happened to you, my loveys? For some of you, this is a group of you, my loveys. Like, what happened to you? How you got so evil? How you get so heartless? What happened to your child? I don't know. What happened to your inner child? What happened to the little boy that would run around and just wanted to play with people and their toys? And I don't know what happened to you. How'd you get so fucking evil? How'd you get so fucking evil? And you think that the world has something against you. But look at everything you fucking do on a daily basis. Look at yourself. Look at your faces. How? What happened to you? delays retardation arrested development what happened where'd you get stuck 
Where did you get stuck? What happened to your love? What happened to this retarded emotional maturity? Because now you go from a king of hearts, a king of clubs with the fucking jack of spades, which is an evil person, an evil man. It's usually an evil man. And it's usually the man, you know, it is the man watching this. The king of clubs is the man watching this. For some of you, I do feel this is you, my lovies. What happened to the emotional space? When are you going to fucking grow up? Fucking triggered all the fucking time. Gluttonous lustful greedy needy clingy crazy abusive if they have a little bit of power they abuse it they're not in it for humanity if everybody was like you the world would be destroyed don't think everyone's like you my lovies not everybody is like you not everybody is living like you not everybody is a psychotic mother effer that needs support not everybody's a fucking escort either People that live like everybody's a fucking escort. I'm telling you, in the preliminary, people trying to pay to have their way with you. It's like, are you fucking stupid? Shot by Cupid. Get the fuck out of here. Again, everything came in earlier for a reason. And they insist they're in a queen, king, king, queen of wands, king of wands, males or females. Because now a queen of wands in the reverse wants to come in. Insecure, jealous possessive, lustful liars. I'm like, where am I seeing a seven of wands? Lustful liars. Always trying to get away with something. Even in their old fucking age. Like, what the fuck? Always up to some, some something about a flamingo. This flamingo energy has been present. Always up to some dumb scheme. Failing their children, failing their communities, failing their own selves. It's like always living in conflict. Don't you get fucking tired of running around looking for drama? Don't you get tired? Yeah, you're fucking tired. It's done. You're fucking tired. Fucking tired. Move away from the damn storm. It's about time. Shit. I'm talking to somebody that's been at this bullshit for a long time. It's like you don't get tired of this bullshit of your own heartbreak. Of your own fucking heartbreak. Always up to some fucking mess. Always up to some mess. Always up to some mess. Someone's gonna get con uh, a conniving. A, ve a, ve ves a vessel. Something about Vanessa. <sighs> some type of offer that was made that's under judgment. Someone made an offer to have someone communicate or travel. It's under judgment. The angels are guarding this. Make sure you're doing the fucking right thing. Queen of Hearts, a sister, a daughter, or a friend, leaving out, abandoned. There's something that's going to change for this person. This King of Wands who betrayed this person, betrayed a daughter, a sister, a friend, betrayed legacies. And then they pretend like they're, they're philanthropists in the community. Look how you treat the people that you're supposed to actually look after. The closest thing. I laugh at the, like I laugh at some of my siblings. I laugh. It's like you go out and you do what for people? Look what you've done to me behind my fucking back. Look at all the hidden attacks. You think God is looking at you like a good person. Look at what you've done behind my back. Look, they want to lower their head. <laughs> it's like, look what you've done behind my back. Look everything you've done behind my back. You pretend to give money to people? You fucking thief of fucking legacies? Look at what you've done. Look at what you've done. Traveling secretly, trying to fucking... Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Gemini, the choice, the lovers, a path opening up to a fucking legacy. 1111, destiny. Trying to control people's fucking destiny. Thinking people are gonna, oh, they're just gonna be in a slumber. They're not, no. The spell work was a fucking blessing to get me the fuck away from you. Quickly. <laughs> Death, it's over. Scorpio energy. Scorpios could be significant for some. And they feel defeated and embarrassed out of envy. They wanted to kill somebody out of fucking envy, psychos. I'm telling you, there's some evil people on this planet. They need a repentance. All of the shame they live with, all of the shame, all of the the shame, the shame is the shame is dangerous. When people say I'm sorry, that is a dangerous curse to throw out there. This leads people to do some evil shit. The story of La Llorona, the mother who killed her own children because a father or a man left her. The Five of Cups energy encompasses that energy in certain tarots. La Llorona, she killed, 
She lives in shame. She lived in shame that her husband left her. What did she do? She went and she killed her. She justified the killing of her children. In Latin America, they're, they're, she's expressed in different ways. But they say, oh, um, there's a story. Um, uh, she killed us. It, the song is kind of like, no, no, nos mató por un, por un ajo que había, fal un diente que faltaba. Um, it's like, she killed us because a garlic, like, basically... The children, in certain stories, the children come home from buying buying uh, garlic. And there was one tooth of garlic that was missing. And that's what set her off to kill them. But the children took it like, look at that. My mom killed me. Like, there's a little song that they sing. And it's like, um, my mom killed me because uh, um, a, a garlic tooth was missing. So people trying to kill you because some like justifying it over some bullshit. This is what's coming in, and they're con they're conflicted, convoluted competition. Unstable mother suckers. Seven of Swords, liars trying to get away with shit. A whole family. And you loved these people. I love them too, my lovies. You loved these people. You still do. Just love them a little di differently now. The <laughs> diddler. Now you love them a little differently now. It's like, I'll love you, but get the fuck away from me. You have not changed. You're only mad you got caught. You gotta go to court too. Eight of Pentacles. The work they've been doing. <sighs> Trying to destroy your work. For some of you, these are people you don't even know. <laughs> I have to emphasize for some of you these are family members for some of you these are people you don't even fucking know working with your family for some of you they're working with your family for some of you you got people that bribed people the choice the lovers Gemini energy and conflict five of wands a path that they were trying to close out it's almost like sending like Sully page of wands but you're gonna get good news anyways coming in very quickly they're also trying to and seven of wands so we got the page of wands the so we have the courts coming in to the five of wands which means that the the courts supersede whatever the five of wands wants to come co convolute uh they want to convolute things they want to confuse things they want to make things uh escalate they want to argue about things you have no arguments. For me, I have no arguments with these. I have no arguments. I don't. I would just show up to court very peacefully. We got good news. That's it. Seven of Wands energy. I have nothing to say to you. It's not like I'm... It's Again, because for some of you, you're not reasoning with people that come to reason. They're coming to argue. Just know that. I'm channeling... Again, I'm channeling a few different energies. It's really heated energy. But for me, this is like... I'm actually like tempering something that could actually turn into a fist fight. This is, this is so just, you know, how my energy, how, how I channel this level right now, what I'm feeling right now, it's like people throwing punches energy. But for some of you, I want you to remember this when you are in this, living this, however this manifests in your life, keep it at a minimum. Say what, say your piece, speak your piece. But if you don't have to say anything, know you're dealing with a group of irrational bullies. That's what they wanted. That's the ch that's the choice they've made. Three of wands and wait for the news because it's coming. I'm just the messenger. You're going to wait for the news too. Like something's going to be on the news for some of you. 4320, wait for the news. I wouldn't go too crazy. Because you're not, you're not dealing emotionally. They're blocked. It's really hard. It's really hard. You're not dealing... You're dealing with people that have a lot of child wounds that they haven't healed. Everything is coming in for a reason. They... You know what I'm getting? You know how it came in earlier? Like, what are you even doing here? For some of you, you're going to show up somewhere because they didn't expect you to show up. And they're going to look at you like, what the fuck are you doing here? Because it's going to set off the whole thing because you are supposed to be there. <laughs> You're actually supposed to be where they don't, where they, 4411, you are supposed to be where they didn't want you. You have some surprise travels. You're supposed to be there, so you better go. If it's, especially if it has to do with the courts or some type of decision that needs to be made, you better show my lovies. You better go. I would make it happen. You got to take the day off. You got to do whatever you got to do. Make it happen. You got to take a week off. Make it happen because you're going to be very happy. If you make it happen, you're going to be very happy. You got some sneaky ass mother effers in, in your field right now. 
Something about a guide. You have your guides with you. Something about gate. You're definitely traveling. We got gate. We have Kate. The letter Z was present in the preliminary. I, I did a typo. 4455. The letter Z was present in the, in the pre preliminary. I did a typo and then I almost like let it go because I'm like that typo means something but it's coming up now. We got something about tin. Something about TNZ, something about TMZ, something about a tie. You have to wear a tie. You have to wear a suit as well. Something about Z U N I Zoomy Zoomies, the store Zoomies. We got Zuni. We got Z, we got N, we got E, we got B, we got bun hair buns for some hair buns a neat bun for some of you you need to uh a neat bun you have to do a neat bun on your hair uh they're gonna hate something we do have hate i do feel hate i feel hate i told you i feel hate they think you hate them too they hate themselves they hate anyone something about a diddler this diddler energy's been very present um the hate is not personal, but there is hate. I do feel it. I'm telling you. Again, I'm channeling. It's making me hot and red because I am channeling energy that these people, they don't know how to deal with their hate. They don't have they don't they don't have the capacity to deal. That's why they're all dying. They don't even know it. That's why they're all dying. They're all spying. They're all lying. They have so much heat. They have so much action that they don't even know. And they're in so much inactivity for the right reasons that they're killing themselves. This energy can really escalate to a fist fight. I am not kidding. I'm not kidding when I'm saying it. These people want to get violent with you because they think you are the, you have become the obsession. I'm not kidding. I'm saying it for a reason. You need some neat buns. For some of you, you have to, for some of you, you're going to pick up buns like hamburger buns. You're, you can have a cookout for some of you. We have some type of bun. We have bunny. We have bunnies for some of you. We got bunnies, my lovies. Oh, that's cute. We got bunnies. We got a bunny or bunnies. Something about bad bunny for some of you. AE, American Airline. You have to eat. You're going to eat rabbit for some of you. You're going to eat bunnies. Boom, bye, cools. I've eaten rabbit. When I was a child, actually, um, so I've shared this with some. Um, I was uh, I was molested by a guy that my mom was dating, um, and he it was for a while, but uh, but he was almost it was so bizarre because he was kind of like a protector too, to be quite frank. Um, but um, he uh, he fed me bunny, he fed me rabbit, he cooked rabbit once. Um, after that, have I ever eaten rabbit again? I don't think I've even... No, Eva. Eva. Evie. I have never eaten rabbit since then. Aha! Someone's going to have an aha moment. Um, You're going to have to eat bunny. For some of you, you're going to eat bunny. For some of you, eat and bunny. <laughs> uh, your cousin. For some of you, your cousin is here esoterically. Your cousins are your best friends for some of you. Um, We got eat at the gate. For some of you, you could eat at the uh, supermarket. You're eating at a supermarket for some of you. For some of you, you could eat at uh, the airport. You could eat rabbit at the airport. A-H, aha, there's going to be an aha moment. A hat, you need a hat for some of you. You're going to hate the hat. You're not going to like the hat. He hates the hat. Someone doesn't like the hat, my lovies. A child may not like a hat. For some of you, you could, you could be trying to put a hat on a child. <laughs> they don't like it. <laughs> they don't like it. Um... We do have some type of bait. So again, someone's going to try to bait you. Be cautious. E, 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 triple E. Triple E and E is the fifth letter of the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, five, five, five. Um, a bait and E, united, united. They're going to, for some of you, or unite. Someone's going to try to say that uh, uh, a baiter who's a hater, a uh, 555 or E, 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 or the initials E, or the initial E could be significant. Um, Someone's going to have an aha moment about this bait. Someone had an aha moment. There's evidence on these people. They didn't think that there was evidence. It's so stupid. It's so stupid. Yeah, their goal is to gain. Their goal is to gain, uh, and they're ready to do anything it takes. I told you, someone is in the king of swords 
in the re okay it's so a king of swords in the reverse so this one's a psycho uh aquarius could be significant king of swords in the reverse uh king of wands in the reverse this person's ready to do anything it takes they are ready this is what's coming in i'm just the messenger here they are ready to even be freddy they are ready because they are really trying their desire their worth their extravagance they really want to get good news. Uh, they want to triumph over being a bully. So they, they're, they're trying to get as many people as they can to be in on their bullshit. And this is a strategy. This is a strategy to cause someone fright, to cause someone fright so that they run away from good news. <laughs> this is what's coming in. I am just the messenger here. I have, people don't think they have fucking problems. This is a trap. In loneliness... To compromise, boom. This is what they're trying to do. I'm just a messenger here. They're trying to they a train to. We got gun. Someone has a gun, boom. Zane. Zane. See you. You see. You see University of California. Uh, a coach in the reverse. So we have someone that coached uh, a group, a crook, a crooked, a crook. This coach is a crook. The number five, a hierophant, Taurus energy, a belief system of people. Bad advice, uh, reckless obedience, and a lack of knowledge or a lack of wisdom in a situation. This family in the reverse. I told you, this is a family. This family in the reverse who are fucking stressed. They are. They're stressed. They're all stressed because they were fucking blind. Anyways, and they ran out of time. <sighs> I'm done, my lovies. 5135. This was all supposed to be a spiritual test because I was getting like a spiritual lesson. It was all supposed to be a spiritual trust. 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 They did something with a trust. Um, they tried to do a binding ritual, but this family is falling apart. They got some type of bad. I, I was also getting something about like someone did a ritual to try to do something like someone did a ritual and they noticed like I, I, for a while they thought they thought they, they, they were getting luck. They believed. I don't know. They believed everything was going according to plan, but they were just blind. They were really blind. They were they thought they were really like having luck in a situation, but it wasn't true. I'm just a messenger, Georgia. It wasn't true. They wanted a gain. They were just obsessed with gain. Something about Cain and Abel. This is like a Cain and Abel type of energy. They were fighting over fucking land. Ay, ay, ay. Again, my love, you take what resonates and leave what doesn't. I'm just a messenger. I'm just a channeler. I'm channeling the energies that are coming in. And these energies are hot, hot. So for some of you, just something about hot pot. Uh, I would keep a, a level head. I really would. I wouldn't talk too much. I really wouldn't. Not with these people. They don't want to talk anyway. They want to fight. They want to fight and maybe even pull out a gun. I'm just a messenger. Because <laughs> you won. Because you won. You won. Them, they, they, they think in winning. 53, 11, 88, and this is going to court. <sighs> it was your destiny to win. They were living a life of sin. They didn't know when to stop. You never raised your hand. You knew, for some of you, you knew this was going to happen. They And they knew they were cursing themselves. Look at this family in this picture. This is what they wanted. Now they feel haunted. They're all trying to stay together as well. For some of you, like you have a group of people trying to stay together, but they fucking hate each other. They do not have love in their life. They are, you have, for some of you, a group of so, so, Soki. This was their, something about Loki, this type of Loki energy. This was their fate. They were told. They were told. They were told. I was getting something about, actually, earlier today. Spirit was giving us how someone went to get a reading done and they went to, they manifested who they are. They manifested a reader that matches. They wouldn't come to Truth Nunez or someone like Truth, for example. They would go to somebody that is going to lie to them just like the liar that they are. That's what they went to. So they went to, they did have hope because at one point, so, someone was told that um, something about Cecilia or Sicilian. Someone was told at one point that everything was going to work out fine for them. 
and it wasn't true it came in with a queen of swords in the reverse so you know male female someone went to a, a reader um that lied to them and it was a straight up lie this is how it came in in the preliminary i'm like okay that's that's where we're gonna go today my lovies okay they went to someone who straight up lied and told them that everything was going to be fine in the situation. Everything you're doing is fine. And it wasn't. It wasn't. It really wasn't. It really was not. It was their fate. It was their fate. They should have listened to the ones they wanted to, again, because Spirit was giving them the games that they were playing. I'm just a messenger here. Again, they believe in Spirit. They believe in Spirit now. Oh, that's good. Well, at least they believe in Spirit now. That's good. Maybe for some of you, it's you that believes in spirit. Because I don't know. These people know spirit said it's them. Now they believe in spirit now. Now they believe in spirit. They had to go through a really difficult lesson successfully to now believe in spirit. So now the karma that they're getting, and this is only the beginning. <laughs> this is only the beginning. Because for some spirit gave us in the preliminary, their karma is unbearable misery. They are not going to be able to live through what they wanted to put, they wanted to uh, project onto you. That's what they wanted to project onto you trying to spy on you seeing you suffer i got something for some of you it's like watching you putting things in place to watch you suffer so they can harvest that energy or their perception of your suffering you weren't even suffering you're like okay these these things aren't working out for me for some reason you didn't know there was this fucking devilish mother effer sneaking in the shadows trying to create chaos in your life they are going to have the time of their lives with this trap they set for themselves. <laughs> they are going to be too busy to even worry about what the fuck you're doing. They are going to be too busy to even... And they're still going to keep stalking you, Spirit saying. They're still going to keep watching you, especially online. They're going to be pissed every time they see you happy, smiling, doing your thing. Keep fucking smiling and doing your thing, my lovies. And hopefully they learn how to love. I mean, I did say that their fate is also to learn from this but they're going to have unbearable suffering for god knows how long until next time i hope they stay strong <laughs> i hope i hope they stay strong hold on where is it my lovies my lovies are showing us something because they wanted to gain and for some of you you have gain through justice <laughs> i'm just the messenger that was your fate for you to gain through justice and they're cursed. <laughs> they're cursed. They're cursed for being too indulgent, for being greedy. Now they have to fucking compromise. They go from being indulgent and all this other stuff to now having to compromise. I would compromise through the courts. I wouldn't compromise talking to these people. I would compromise through the courts. And it's also this family's going to fall out anyway. So you're going to stop talking to these people. Or you already have. It's just like loose ends need to be tied. That's it. So wear your suit and your tie and your and your cute stuff and go get them. And and your neat bun. <laughs> Make yourself a neat bun because they say, for some of you, they were trying to say that your hair is crazy and that's why you're crazy. I don't know. These people were all types of shit shows. People that you even stood in front of people, talked great about them, supported them in all of their endeavors. And it, it's, it's just, they forgot. They forgot. They forgot. But they're about to remember. Anyways, my love, you stay well. Wow. Stay well. Stay absolutely well because your sister friend loves you. They live in shame and adores you. They live in self-hatred. Loves you and adores you. May they heal. Your sister friend loves you and adores you. <laughs> loves you and adores you. Your spirit friends love you and adore you. Love you and adore you. Your sister friend. And your spirit friends. Something about Doris and something about Dolores. And your spirit friends and your sister friend. In love always, in love always, in love always and forever. Honeys, homies, peace.